What's up, everyone? Uh, we're here to celebrate, I don't know if it's a birthday. It's my dad's birthday. Is it? Yeah. Is it really? This okay. is for you, dad. This is for you. <laughs> if you're watching Marco's dad, um, thanks, for raising, him, thanks yes. for raising a good son. <laughs> Uh, but we are here to talk about guitar birthday, New Gear Day uh, for for Marco. We we want to kind of just share our personal journey with you guys as well, like cool guitars that we get. Um, we are guitar nerds as well. We happen to make pickups. If you're watching this video because you clicked on the title and saw this cool guitar we're about to talk about, uh, that's fine. Uh, we'd love to just let you know we are makers of electric guitar pickups, and that is our day job. That is what we're doing right now. Uh, Every day we're taking a little break, a little detour. Yeah. Not too much because we're going to actually talk about this guitar. So I'm going to turn it over to you, Marco, because you are stoked. I'm stoked for you. Got to play this thing for the first time yesterday. And what a fantastic guitar. So why don't you uh, share with the fine folks what you got? Yeah, yeah. I'm holding it out of the frame just to, just to build suspense. But even I know they saw it in the thumbnail. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I really uh, went into it this time. And this is a... Uh... A Novo Voltour J is what it's called, and so it's got two P90s, um, and then a, this really cool mastery bridge uh, mm. with this cool like arm on it, which is so. I'm not a like a trem guy, really. I'm not, yeah. a, so I don't really have opinions on any of this stuff. Um, just normally, I'm like, oh, trems are usually a headache, but so mm. far this thing has just been so nice, and I'm like, oh, I get why people are like. Yeah. mastery or like these style of trims over even like traditional fender ones or whatever um, I've had more experience with Floyd roses and those just seem to be a headache but yeah this is really cool I don't, I don't have anything with two p90s in it so I guess I do now and this is a really cool black so it goes with my outfit and yeah. everything color but this has a candy apple green underneath nice and we'll do some flyovers kind of as we've been talking we'll fly over some most up close shots of the guitar. We'll probably do some more feature stuff with this guitar. So again, just a just an introduction to a happy new year day for Marco. We are, uh, I would say, we're both guitar enablers for each other. You know, anytime we're thinking about and this was a kind of a surprise. Like you didn't tell me that you were going to buy this. Yeah, yeah. And you told me when you you bought it, um, which I'm totally fine with, mm -hmm. by the way. But sometimes we're thinking about guitars, and you're like, oh, you should get this because it, it'd be really cool, or. You know, you work really hard, you deserve this, or something like you yeah. always kind of like pet me up. And, and same same here. I'm just like, I'm really excited for you because one of the things we've been really trying to uh, stay on top of, of is our inspiration, our guitar inspiration, and like being inspired by new guitars that come in. And so um, we want to just share the excitement of this guitar with you. Um, really fantastic. If you have any questions about this guitar, you can put them in the comments and Marco or I can answer. If I know, if not, you can you can be the one that answers the question about this. I'm really, really impressed with the guitar overall. But we're gonna kinda, kinda at the end of this section here, just start, sort of talk about pickups because obviously when we get a guitar, we have to think, are we gonna, are we gonna swap the pickups right away? Are we gonna, you know, with the PRS that we had a ways back, we waited probably, I don't know, a month or so at least, right? Mm -hmm. Before we yeah. swapped out the pickups. And so kind of, uh, we can start with wherever you want to go with this, it's your guitar. So um, kind of what are you thinking about the pickups and, and will you porterize the guitar? Will you kind of hybrid the guitar? What, what's kind of your current thought being that you only only have had it for a couple of days? Yeah, I mean, well, so far it's, it's so awesome. And I really do like these pickups. These come stock with Freyland pickups, which I think if you're not getting our pickups, you should probably be getting those pickups, mm -hmm. um, personally, but good, good uh, company. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Solid. Um, or Duncan's or whatever, but yeah, I'm surprised I haven't pulled them out because normally I do that. And maybe because I pulled them out of the other one so quickly before mm -hmm. Brian really got to experience, you know, kind of the sound I was like, ah, oh, maybe, maybe I'll let, I'll let him hear what these sound like when they, yeah. when they show up. But, and I appreciate that. Cause I don't normally, you know, people ask us, can you compare this to this? And, and we don't really do pickup comparisons. If you figure that out, we really don't mention other brands of pickups, but we often also don't get to try them, mm -hmm. right? Cause they're not coming through the door necessarily. Sometimes if someone brings in a guitar, that's, you know, Gibson loaded with stock pickups and we get to hear them and then take them out and put ours in there. Yeah. So we just sort of have this weird sort of a uh, cross section of pickups because we, we hear them a little bit, but then we make our own. Mm -hmm. So, and uh, yeah, so I do, I wanted to just kind of let it like we did with the PRS, just kind of let it sit, see what it's going to do. Um, and I was like, all right, I'm just going to like, let it be what it is for a minute. But 
but I just can't help myself. And I've already started kind of like, oh, maybe I need <laughs> something in this output range and maybe with this magnet. And I looked at one of our favorite like eBay supplier sellers and I'm like, oh, these are some magnets that uh, we've not really like had a lot of um, use case for or experimentation with. So I was like, well, maybe this is a good like avenue to experiment with some new magnets. Like mm -hmm. we, we all know Alnico 5 and Alnico 2, but what about like Alnico 6 or something or... You know, yeah. a hybrid ceramic Alnico pickup. I'm not sure. So maybe I'll wind a couple different coils and then I'll like pick two that I'm like, all right, these are my most favorite. And then we'll like have a shootout or something. I I'm not sure. Yeah. But I know I really do like this neck pickup. It's like mid six range. Maybe I would say like medium, like on the way to seven. So mm -hmm. like six, 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 seven. It's really cool sounding, actually, really clear. And then this pickup is like 8K, which sounds really awesome and it's really clear. I think I've gotten used to like a little bit more output. It, it's like a, I was talking about like, oh, it's a picking thing. But there's like, I hear like the plinkiness, which I know is like a useful thing. And some people really like want that to come through over like the low end or whatever. I just need it to kind of push a little bit more. So mm. I know I'll definitely change this one. Maybe this will stay, but it's like if you change one, might as well change the right. other. Maybe like you'll learn something new. So I'm still kind of scheming. Yeah. Um, but we know it's, it's going to be different. It's different when it's your guitar and you're thinking, well, this is my guitar. And, and how do I, you know, sounds like what you're doing, basically kind of what we do with our pickup chooser mm. form for, for yourself, right? You're kind of like, okay, should I go this path or this path? And then if I went this path and... You know, part of it is the craziness that's in your head of, of like thinking through magnets and combinations and then figuring out what would balance this guitar. And I think, you know, the fact that you're kind of giving it like some time yeah, to then try something. Because we were talking about this earlier today as we were building stuff in the shop, just kind of the, the idea of like, well, we have sort of have this weird, I, I want to call it an advantage, but it can be. Sometimes when a guitar plays great but sounds bad, we usually can fix that with the pickups. That's kind of why we why we do what we do. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah. you and I look at guitars a lot differently, right? We we see the guitars and we say like, well, I can I can fix that part of it, or or you're saying I want more out of the bridge, and you're like you're not going to send the guitar back, yeah, but you might want to change it from what stock is, and it's not that stock is bad, right? That's kind of the mm -hmm. same thing we experience with the PRS of, well, it sounds really good, but we I think we can we can notch it up a couple more, more levels. And so, yeah, we're going to be sharing, uh, kind of what the, I, I guess maybe the process, I don't know. We'll see where this goes, right? You may decide to do nothing. You may decide to do yeah. <laughs> something. Um, maybe if we do make any changes, we'll kind of share some sound clips of what we did and, and just kind of let people know. But, um, yeah, congratulations by the way. Yeah. And, uh, it's wild, super, super cool. Um, if you've got Novo guitars, let us know what you think of them. And, uh, yeah, we'd love to kind of hear your comments on them in general. And we just, we love all things guitar and mm -hmm. you're definitely like, this is Novo number two for you now. So you're, uh, you're definitely going down, you're going down that path, which is super cool. And I'm, I'm really excited and genuinely excited for you and, and what, what this guitar is going to do for like your musical journey. So if you've got a guitar brand that you like, that you think we should check out sometime, let us know. We're obviously always looking for guitar companies to work with. You know, this is the shameless plug at the end here. Um, <laughs> you know, any any guitar companies that need pickups, we do work with a lot of really great guitar companies and provide them pickups. And so we always like trying the guitars um, and then trying it with our pickups in there and then kind of seeing how it works. Because at the end of the day, if we work with with a company, that's what we're trying to do. Mm -hmm. Trying to fit fit the right set to the to the right instrument. So. We'll be, uh, we'll be back again with a specific guitar and again, just a quick flyover of kind of, uh, what it is and, and, uh, it's probably time to, to, uh, do some playing now. Yeah. All yeah. right. We'll, we'll catch you guys on the next video with some new, new tones in this guitar. Cool.